What's up, YouTube? Mohunnis100. And today I'm actually going to be showing you guys some new arcade cabinets by uh, Arcade 1UP. They're a new company. They're putting out these 3 4 scale arcade cabinets. And um, they're about uh, five, uh, 4 feet tall. But um, right here, from here to here, they're 4 feet. And then there's an extra foot if you add these risers. So uh, they're about 5 feet tall. Um, they're definitely playable standing up. You can take the riser off of it and it'll be playable sitting down. Um, or you can just get like a tall uh, bar stool like this. This one works perfect. Um, you can put the bar stool in front of it and, you know, you can play. It's it's pretty easy. Um, they're easy to set up. They come in a box and they they go together just like maybe like, you know, furniture you would get from, you know, any furniture store headboard or a dresser um they're they're pretty sturdy I, I mean i like them they're about they're about 63 pounds each and um this is the atari 12 and 1 deluxe model it actually comes with the riser i think this one's 4.99 because this one has 12 games and then the street fighter one comes with three games um this is one of my favorite series i got you know ryu statue and some street fighter headbands and stuff on it that one's probably my favorite. If I could only get one, I would get the Street Fighter one just because you can fight and and it kind of resonates with everybody if you um you know, if you play it two players and stuff. This one's two players as well. I actually just picked this one up from Walmart. It's a Walmart exclusive. Um these things are going selling out like crazy, the Galaga machines, and as it should, it's it's a really fun game. Um you can see the cabinet art. It's really nice. Um, and then, you know, you got the Street Fighter one. I do have a protective cover on here. So they get, they send like a plastic piece that to mold. I ordered it for these two as well, but, um, you probably will need it. I'll turn it on. Give you guys a look at what they, how they play and stuff. <sighs> So they're they're pretty nice. I mean, for two ninety nine, this one being three ninety nine, you're not gonna get a better deal, especially when other arcade machines are three four hundred pounds, and these ones are you know sixty three pounds each. They're easily movable. You know, you can you can play them standing up. You can play them sitting down, and then you don't have to replace parts and worry about dust corrosion and things like that on older arcade cabinets. Um, this one has Asteroids, Deluxe, Asteroids, Major Havoc, which is my favorite game on this cabinet, <clears throat> Quantum, Gravatar, Tempest, Missile Command, Centipede, Lunar Lander, Millipede, Crystal Castles, which my nephew really likes. I don't, I don't know. It's like a, it's kind of like Pac-Man, but a little 3D. Liberator, and these are all the games on the Atari 12 and 1. So there's 12 games in there. This one is really just three versions of Street Fighter 2. You got the Champion Edition. You got Street Fighter 2, the new Challengers. And then you got Street Fighter 2 Turbo. It's set to Turbo 2. So um, it's it's pretty cool. I mean, I play Turbo. But, I mean, the other ones are just as good. But, um, yeah, it has one speaker. And the speaker is really loud. So you can also adjust the volume. So you can set it to low or off but um they're really cool I, this one's probably my favorite to play by myself just because i'm over here trying to hit my high scores and stuff me and my sister are competing we kind of grew up on galaga and i mean every high score on here is me so she's not really any competition she's kind of competing with herself so yeah these things are great um i'm gonna cut the the volume but yeah, for the price, I mean, this one being 400, this one being three, and this one being three, these three machines right here are a grand. So for a thousand dollars, you got 17 games on here. They have authentic controls. I mean, you got the, you know, the the trackball for the trackball games, the spinner. So that's really cool. I mean, you got the the fight sticks with the button layout. Everything's authentic. This one is just left, right, and then fire. So, I mean, you can get you a, 
one and plug it up to your TV, but it's not going to have the same controls and it's just not going to be authentic. And these ones, the emulation is great. Um, it feels like I'm playing it on an actual arcade machine. So, I mean, that's, that's what they're going for. And it feels really authentic. Even on this one, uh, his name is actually Balrog, but the, on the original cabinet, they spelled it Barlog and they just kept that in there. And it's just that little detail and accuracy that makes these things really nice. You know, I mean, if you want to get a street fighter two champion edition, it's like four or five grand, but this way you get one. It's newer. It's got newer parts. Um, I, I believe they're like uh, LED screens. And the controls are great. I mean, the control panel is is pretty it's pretty solid. The buttons have micro switches. You can swap the buttons out for something, you know, a little more quality if you want. It's not even expensive to do that, and it's pretty easy. But, um, yeah, that's my uh, take on the RK 1UP and um their machines and i think they're great and i'm looking forward to maybe getting another one or two i know there's a pac-man coming out as well